るよ。ねえ Beauty. Finally, the rain stops and we start yeah. catching a few. Just think what will happen if the sun comes out. In the oh, next I know, couple it's going to be lights out. Huh? It's going to be lights out. Ooh, big beauty. Look at that. Ooh, nice. Beautiful. Boy, they're dark, ain't they? Yep, on BMC Hair Jig. That is awesome. Al and I are catching smallmouth up in Ontario. We're staying at Dog Lake Resort right outside of Thunder Bay. We're in Squatch neighborhood. Squatch watch. Oh. Got him. Yeah. Yeah, good one. Yeah. Big fish. <laughs> yeah. My oh, hero. Man. Oh boy, oh boy. Nice fish. Oh boy, I can't, I can't stop it. I love this. I love it, I love it, I love it. That's why we come, that's why we come up north into these Canadian lakes. Yeah, yeah, look at that fish. He's nuts on. He's, it's just crazy, just crazy. <laughs> whoa! Oh, you got him on the bottom side. You yeah. Swung at it and yeah, yeah. That, it. Uh, whoa! Hang on. Hang on. I'll get that jig out of you. Look at that. Another good one. Uh, nice fish. Look at that. When they start coming in like this, and you get in the right spot. Yeah, you know, they, they're not rubbed up yet. They're just thinking about coming in and going to bed. Yep. Yeah, yeah, you know, but that's some nice, nice smallmouth, you know, in this part of the world. Yeah, you know, I don't know if some of you that are watching uh, the show, yeah, you know, this would be a bucket trip, a dream trip for a lot of people. You know, if you fly redfish a lot, l l lakes that uh, are loaded with big smallmouth like this, the month of June, it is incredible. Dog Lake here has got a number of places that you can go. Paul put you on the fish. Yeah, yeah, you know, it, uh, it's so much fun. Yeah, yeah, you know, if it's a bucket list for you, you might want to consider giving Paul or, or, or some of the other camp operators up in this part of the world that we know so well that have a lot of good smallmouth uh, fisheries available. It's some of the best smallmouth fishing in the world all over this part of the world. Yeah, like what Al was saying, we do a lot of trips up into Ontario uh, throughout the year. And one thing that we always do is, is plan for the worst and hope for the best. And you will run into foul weather. And the last couple of years, we've been wearing this blackfish stuff. And I'm not kidding you, I am so happy with this gear. It's built for fishermen by fishermen. I mean, it's, it's uh, flexible. You can uh, do everything. It's bulletproof. I mean, I've sat in torrential downpours and you know when you're sitting like this and that water keeps on cupping right here and soaks through, doesn't do it. Looks like we got some weather coming in now. Yeah, I'm, I'm looking suits at suits it. Suits back on. Suits huh? on, suits on, suits off, depending on the cloud cover and the rain. 